Good morning everyone! It is indeed a wonderful Wednesday morning, uh, August 26, 2020. Our devotional reading for today was from the book of Psalms 119, 89 to 176 and 1 Corinthians 8. Our reading was entitled Spiritual Rising, written by Adam Holtz. Our Bible verse is from Ephesians 5, 15 to 16, and it says, Be careful then how you live, not as unwise, but as wise, making the most of every opportunity because the days are evil. I don't remember any specific about my driver's education class, but for some reason, an acronym we learned, SIP. D-E, firmly lodged in my memory. The letters stood for scan, identify, predict, decide, and execute, a process we were taught to practice continually. We were to scan the road, identify hazard, predict what the hazard might do, decide how we'd respond, and then, if necessary, execute the plan. It was a strategy for being intentional to avoid accidents. I wonder how the idea might translate to our spiritual lives. In Ephesians 5, Paul told Ephesians believers, Be careful then how you live not as unwise, but as wise. Paul knew certain hazards could betray the Ephesians. Old ways of living at odds with their new life in Jesus. So, he instructed the growing church to pay attention. The words translated, be careful then how you live, literally means see how you walk. In other words, look around, notice hazard, and avoid personal pitfalls like drunkenness and wild living. Instead, the apostle said, we can seek to learn God's will for our lives, while with fellow believers, we sing and give Him thanks. No matter what hazards we face, and even when we stumble, we can experience our new life in Christ as we grow in dependence in His boundless power and grace. What strategy do you use to recognize what might tip you spiritually? What role do you think other believers play in identifying and resisting spiritual hazards? How might thanksgiving be an important part of avoiding spiritual pitfalls? Let us pray. Heavenly Father, as I navigate the spiritual pathholes in life's road, thank you for reminding me to look up to you for help. Amen. <music>